Hey! Now I go to show you how to make a Discord bot using the Discord.py library. Making bot with Python is a pretty simple way. This video contains a brief instruction to preparing, installation and creating Discord bot. And also I will talk on how to add simple commands to your own bot. I just want to warn you, I am not a professional programmer. Moreover, I started using Python relatively recently. Please subscribe to this channel. Here I will upload more videos about programming bots and other projects using Python and Node.js. Subscription is free. Ok, let's move on to creating the bot. First you need to prepare Discord test server and Discord bot account. Let's create a server. Go to Discord app and click on big plus button which says, add a server. Select, create my own. And then click create leaving the default customization. Ok, the test server has been created. Now let's create a bot account. Go to the official Discord website. You must be logged into this site. On the main page go to the bottom. Here click on the link which named, Developers. Ok, on the page for Developers go to Applications, and now you need to create new. To do this click on the New Application button. Type here the name you want, and the click Create. Ok, next go to the Bot Settings. Click on the Add Bot button. Confirm this action, just click Yes. Done, Bot account has been created. And now let's add this bot to recently created test server. Go to the authorization settings. In the scopes setting tick the bot checkbox. And then select what permissions the bot will have on your server. It is not recommended to give the bot administrator rights, because if your token is recognized by scammers, you can lose the server. To minimize damage, give the bot only those rights that are necessary for the bot to work. I want to make a text bot, then I tick this text permissions. OK. Now copy this invite link and just paste this into the address bar. Here select your test server that has been recently created. You did everything correctly if you see this message on your server. And now go to the bot settings again and copy the token. It is needed further. Bot on the server and now we can start programming this bot on Python. So, to create a bot, you need to install the latest stable version of Python, and any text editor, or development environment. It is better to use something that is optimized for Python coding, such as, Sublime Text, or Eclipse. I will use Visual Studio for this. This is most convenient for me. Visual Studio is free. To install the latest version of Python, just tick this checkbox in the Visual Studio installer. OK, after Visual Studio has been downloaded and installed, open it. Here you need to create a new project. Select the Python language and create a new command line Python application. Click next and then select a location where your project will be created. Type a project name. OK click on the create button. Now you can see Visual Studio development environment. Before programming the bot you need to install discord.py library. To do this click, view, and then, terminal. After this you can see the PowerShell session in the bottom of the screen. To install the needed library type here, py-3-m, pip install, dash u, discord.py. I already have this installed. Ok, now you need to create the config file. Go to the right side of the screen and right click on the your project name. Select, add, and, new item. You need to create an empty python file with the name, config.py. In this file place the token of your bot. Type, token, equals, and paste in the single quotes token that you can copy from the bot settings page. Ok, save this file, and go to the main code tab. Now you can start writing the main code of the discord bot. First import the discord python API. Type, import, discord. Then import the recently created config file with the token. Create new instance of the Discord client for the bot. To do this type, client, equals, my client, and brackets. Then run this client. Type, client, dot, run, and in the bracket center, config.token. This is your bot token from the config file. Ok, now you need to check if you did everything right. To do this, we will create a function that prints a message about successful authorization to the console. Let's create a my client class. Type, class, my client in the brackets, discord.client, and colon in the end of the line. And here you can write any events of your bot. Create a ready function, that says if our bot is authorized or not. Enter, async, def, on, 
underscore, ready, in the brackets, self, colon. And inside this function, print, bracket, single quote, logged on as, zero in curly brackets, close single quote, dot format, and in the brackets, self dot user. Close all brackets. Then let's create one more function, that prints all message from the Discord server in the console. To do this type, async def, on underscore message, in the brackets, self, comma, message. Put a colon at the end of the line. And in the body of this function, print, bracket, single quote, message from, in the curly brackets, zero dot author, colon, in the curly brackets again, zero dot content, close the single quote, dot, format, and in the brackets, message. Pay attention to the formatting of the code. Okay, now just save this code. And run this project. Then the console session will open. If you did everything correctly, you will see this message here. Go to the Discord app. As you can see my bot has online status. And if I try to write something to my test server, for example, hello, I will get this message in the console. As you can see, creating a Discord bot in Python is pretty simple. Now let's get down to practice. I will create a Discord bot that will show the weather anywhere in the world. With this example I will show you how to work with the command handler. Let's make this code a little shorter. Instead client, enter here, bot. Remove unnecessary lines of code. OK, then type, from discord.xd import, tasks comma commands. This is needed to create commands. And above the ready function enter, at bot.event. Now, in order to get information about weather anywhere in the world, you need to install the Pyome library. Go to the PowerShell session at the bottom of the screen, and type here, py-3-m, pip install, pyome. I already have this library installed. Next go to the code editing, and import this library. Type, from pyome, import owm. Then ohm, equals, ohm, in the brackets and in the single quotes put the API key, that can be found on the open weather website. Sign up here, and go to the My API Keys page. Copy this key and paste in the code. Then enter, mgr, equals, ohm.weather, underscore, manager, and brackets. And now before creating a command enter this, bot equals, command.bot, and in the brackets indicate the desired prefix. I will use exclamation mark as prefix. Now you can create a command. First enter, at bot.command. And then, async def, command name, in my case it's weather. In the brackets, ctx, comma, arg. Many cities have two word names. To take this, put a star here. Add the colon at the end of the line. Then let's fill this function. Take a new variable place, that equals string with city name. Next we need to get a weather information of the desired city from the open weather website. This can be done by entering this two lines. More information about this library you can find on the GitHub page. All used links you can find in the description. Ok, then just send current temperature in the Discord server. To do this type, await, ctx.send, and in the quotes you need to make an answer, in the city that correspond to the argument. Now, and to get the temperature enter this, str, brackets, w.temperature, in the brackets, celsius, and in the square brackets type, temp. I forgot to replace this and remove self in the ready function. Ok, now bot is ready. Let's run the bot. Go to the discord app, and send the weather command. Type exclamation mark, weather, and name of needed city. For example, in London now almost 7 degrees Celsius. And in New York now slightly over 8 degrees. I will leave the source code of this bot in the description. In this video, I covered the basics of creating a Discord bot in Python. I will be very happy if this video is useful to at least one person. Please write a comment if you want to see more advanced guides about creating Discord bots or Telegram bots. Please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching, see you later.